my friends welcome back to my channel SciTech here. In this video I am going to talk about the new type of notification control center after Android 13 in the realme smartphone. So these are the new type of notification panel looks like after Android 13. So maybe it might be implemented with the realme UI 4.0 as well regarding the new type of notification control center. That's what I am going to discuss in this video. So previously this used to be the notification control center if you remember as you can see this is old type of realme control center exactly and this is a new type of control center. So right now I am going to uh, walk through a few of the features what you can actually expect in the new type of control center after Android 13 update in the realme smartphones. Right now I am trying to use the realme GT2 as an example in this video for the demonstration purpose. The first quick change you will be able to notice these are the alignment is right now regarding the Wi-Fi and the mobile data connection as you can see clearly the difference between the Wi-Fi and mobile data. So if you remember the MIUI also updated to the similar kind of uh, layout like Wi-Fi and the mobile data keeping on the top and rest of the things are in the bottom. And you can straight away click this arrow mark to get connect, uh, to get notified with other, other Wi-Fi connections as well on this arrow mark. That's also a pretty useful thing. I can definitely say that. And if you need to pull down, you'll be able to see a lot of other options here, which are available even with the multi-user as well. So this is a direct shortcut where you can actually select a uh, customized uh, user base. And one more thing I did observe the aptic feedback got slightly improved and better. I can, when you're trying to increase and decrease the brightness, you can feel that aptic feedback slightly like strong, slightly strong, stronger I do feel a little bit kind of improved than before so that's something uh, you should know about and let me slightly decrease the brightness and you cannot pull it down so that's that's how the maximum it can actually come down it cannot come uh, completely down you can see the difference as well in the previous realme it can come till down but right now it cannot come down like this as you can see here that's a small difference which I thought of just mentioning for you all and let me just quick side and there you can get the couple of other uh, things as well small arrow mark will be there on that you can try to select which type of screenshot you want and even the hotspot also you do have the option to select the hotspot and you can click on the edit mode and you can edit tiles what are the different tiles you want to activate even if you want you can change this and you can keep that silent mode on the top if you wish you can change that or maybe the torchlight as well flashlight you can change in this way these are the few type of um, tiles you can actually add on the top as you can see these are the few more which you got right now QR code scanner and app lock and everything and let's go to the settings option and see what other additional settings to do have in the notification center and these are the notification and status bar looks like and let's click on the status bar and you, here you can select what are the different options you want so all those things I did see in the previous realme UI as well nothing much has been changed more settings you can actually select so one more thing is about the notification history is also available as you can see that's also possible you can actually enable that notification history option by default that's also a pretty useful thing but overall friend, these are the few things which you should know about the notification control center after the android 13 update and right now even after android 13 still the phone is running on the realme ui 3.0 so that's what that's maybe in the realme ui 4.0 also we might see similar kind of implementation regarding overall uh, notification panel that's the reason I did mention this control panel looks like realme UI 4.0 upgrade version only so meanwhile signing off until then straight off more updates and uh, bye